Would you drink this water? I think it's safe to assume your answer is no. And you do get to make that choice. You don't have to drink this dirty, polluted water because you can easily access safe, clean drinking water. But for over 844 million people, they don't get to make that choice. Imagine you are one of these people. You would make the six kilometer trip to fetch water multiple times a day. And because of that, you have never received any form of education. Climbing over steep hills and rocks with 44 pounds of water on top of your head, which is why your back and neck have hurt ever since you could remember. And despite the effort, your family still has barely enough water to get through the day. And the water that you do have? Well, it's disease-ridden, dirty, and contaminated with specks of dust and insects that could give you life-threatening illnesses. Every year, 3,575,000 people die from water-related diseases. This is equivalent to a jumble jet crashing every single hour. Sustainable development goal number six aims to ensure everyone has access to clean water and sanitation. The UN explains, clean water and sanitation is a basic human need, one that should be accessible to all. There are sufficient resources to achieve this, yet worldwide, one in three people do not have access to safe drinking water, and 40% of people do not have access to basic washing facilities with soap and clean water. For 673 million people, having to relieve yourself means digging a hole, which not only compromises one's hygiene severely, but having to go out in the open exposes you to increased risk of sexual assault. Poor sanitation and contaminated water causes the transmission of diseases such as cholera, hepatitis A, polio, and typhoid. Diarrhea as a result of inadequate sanitation and lack of safe drinking water alone accounts for the death of 829,000 people each year, 297,000 of which are children who will never live past their fifth birthday. Dirty water causes the death of a human being every 10 seconds. Since the start of this video, 13 people have already passed away due to water contamination. Access to sanitation is essential for human dignity, health, and well-being. Currently, 4.2 billion people lack safely managed sanitation. Imagine going through your period and not being able to clean yourself with soap or water. In India, only 12% of menstruators have access to sanitary products, leaving the rest to use unsafe materials like rags and sawdust, causing viral infections as a result. No one should be forced to live a life like this. Clean water and sanitation should not be a privilege. It's a right. Some people play Russian roulette with death every single time they take a sip of water. Is this the world you would want to live in? I think it's safe to assume your answer is no.